What is up everyone? Welcome to my channel. Today we are diving into Avatar Frontiers of Pandora. I have just been so excited for this game. I absolutely love the Avatar films, the Avatar franchise. And so I've been really looking forward to playing this game for a while now. If you haven't done so, you can go check out my reaction video to the game trailer as well as the unboxing for my collector's edition of this game. It is my first collector's edition, so I'm just so grateful and happy to have it in my possession. <laughs> now, I will be receiving the soundtrack of this game on vinyl soon enough. It's supposed to be releasing sometime in spring of this year, so <laughs> we are kind of there. It should be coming soon. <laughs> so I'm so happy to add that to my collection. I have to warn you guys that I will be spending a ton of time just exploring Pandora, getting lost, learning everything I can about the creatures and the surroundings, and just learning how to live as a not be. So <laughs> I do apologize <laughs> for that. <laughs> but yes, this is just one of those worlds that I have always dreamed of living in. It's just so magical. <laughs> and yeah, oh man, it is such a dream. <laughs> I will note that I do struggle with first person point of view, so it will be some time before I get used to the camera angle, the mechanics, and the combat. Um, also, I have never played a first-person shooter, so this is completely new, the combat. <laughs> um, but I am excited. I'm looking forward to it. Also, bow and arrow is my favorite weapon in games, so I will be using that majority of the time, I'm pretty sure. But I will attempt to use the rifle and the shotguns. <laughs> Other than that, I hope you guys enjoy relish in the beauty that is Pandora. <laughs> I am so excited, so let's get into it. Okay, so I'm going to stick with medium because I have heard the combat is quite challenging in this game. And since I have no experience with first person shooter type games, I'm going to. I think medium is good. And yeah, I'll definitely stick with Guidance. I will be exploring, but I need a guide. <laughs> mm. Oh, this is so beautiful. I love that. I don't know what they're called, the flying lizards. <laughs> oh my gosh, this would look incredible on VR, wouldn't it? Twenty-one forty-six, eight years before the Battle of the Hallelujah Mountains, inside the Ambassador Program, residential school for Navi children. Mm. Good morning. Let's review the Ambassador Program. When the RDA discovered Pandora, you can't discover something that was there all along. Happy. When we say discovered, we mean it was the first time humans came here. When we arrived, we realized that this was an opportunity to create beneficial relationships with the indigenous peoples. 
We created avatars like mine to help create Is she distracted? Not be. And when you Dr. Alma. It'll be your job as ambassadors to reach out to the not the clans and to Oh, so she's human. Create those alliances. Can um anyone tell me how that can be done? <laughs> the RDA can share their medicines, technologies, and knowledge. That's absolutely correct, Tila. Director Mercer. It's so weird to see them with- We have been going over Tap's mission as you requested. With normal human clothes. Why would <laughs> we want to have alliances with you? <laughs> Alma. You have no idea what life is like out there, Ahari. It's savage. Savage. We found you as children. After your clan abandoned you, we have given you a future. That is fear mongering. Total BS. <laughs> Our clan would never have abandoned us. Built up on its land. Let's walk it. Stop. I allowed you to keep that dirty trinket under the condition oh. it remained in your bunk. Hmm? How dare he? <laughs> Hand it over. No. It was our mother's. It's not a dirty trinket. You don't even know what a song chord is. Oh, song chord. Sorry. It's just a broken string. Wow, even at her age, she's stronger difficult for you, than him. You have to accept that your mother abandoned you. Lies. Liar. <gasps> Good looking at. <laughs> you all know the rules. No physical contact. No dinner for any of you. Director Mercer, sir. Oh. Manor, Manor, the ends. Oh, no, 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 Director Mercer saved us. No, he didn't. He's using you. Daylon, they took us from our families. We are saplings cut from our roots. We may not remember where we're from, but we can still grow out there on Pandora. I can't even remember the words of our clan songs anymore. We can sing them even without words. I wonder how old they were when they were taken. We can't let them strip the nut V out of us. We have to do something before it's too late. We are stronger than them now. I felt it in the classroom with the Mercer. Hmm. We can end this tonight. I have an idea. They must have been like babies or something. Good job, Daylan. Now we have to hurry. We only have a few minutes breathing the air before we're going to need a mask. Do they think they can't breathe in Pandora? We found them. I'm very disappointed in you. <laughs> We have given you this privileged life, and you want to throw it all away. We don't want your privileged life. We belong out there. No, you belong to us. You cannot fathom how much we have invested in you. Hmm? We saved you, gave you a home, an identity. We already had an identity. We are not me. No! You are what I made you. If it isn't obvious, we should hate the humans. <laughs> we may not remember the words, 
But we can still sing the songs of our people. Stop singing. Shut up! Stop singing! We are going home. I'm warning you, Ahari. Not another step! Stop right there! Stop right there! Stop right there! Stop right there! I knew it. What did you do? No, no, no. <gasps> oh, you better give that back. Eight years later, Toruk Magto and the Amatakaya are rising up against the RDA. Holy cow. Jeez. So today we will continue our talk about Earth economics and the laws of supply and demand. Oh, Why do fun. we have to use human weapons? <gasps> or we've been over this. Pandora is a very dangerous place. Oh, eight Maybe years later. Pandora. How do we know what we're protecting ourselves against? It's so Our interesting. They're making them scared of their now. own home. Look, orders have come down from Hell's Gate. We are being evacuated from Pandora. You need to drive your stuff before, before the panic starts. What? Look, we have lost Pandora. Some avatar driver named Jake said he <laughs> Turn the Navi on us. That's why you can't trust any of them. I would do and the you same. Get your stuff together and get back to your own damn body now. Puppet show is over. Okay, everyone, collect your things. Hey, Cortez, I will handle this. You need to go. Jake Sully. You know what to do. No, you don't. Execute us? Yes! Follow me! Oh my Quickly. gosh! We've got this one chance! Come on! Oh my gosh! Ian, what are you doing? You'll be safe here. Is Mercer leaving us? We are no longer of use to him. No! I, I won't believe it! Hurry! You need to hide! Uh, let us go. We can take them. We can escape to Pandora. There are soldiers everywhere. You won't make a single step. This is our chance to be free. This is your only chance to survive. What about you? You're just going to go to sleep for a little while. <laughs> I, I forgot this is my point of view. It won't be long, OK? And it's not just the camera. <laughs> Character customization? Oh my gosh. Okay, I did wanna... Okay, for those who are new to the whole Avatar world, uh, to differentiate between the real not V and the humans that are taking the Avatar or using the Avatar is that the real not V only have four fingers. So, three fingers and a thumb. And then the humans who are using avatars to beat Navi have the five fingers. So that's one way to differentiate. And then also a song chord was only recently introduced in the second film, The Way of Water. And I believe, not 100% sure, but I believe a song chord is sort of 
the way that they share their stories and memories using beads. And yeah, I think they often sing <laughs> when they are sharing those stories. That's why it's called a song chord. Ugh, I just remembered that the song chord that Neytiri sung in Way of Water. Oh, so beautiful. It's one of my favorites. <laughs> Such a beautiful song. I always blast it on my record player. It's so beautiful. So. Yes, we are going to stick. You helped me before. I'll help you now. Stay where you're needed. You helped me before. I'll help you. You helped me before. Yeah, you me I like before. that. I'll help you now. Stay where you're needed. All right. So. One, two. Actually, one is nice. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I also like seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's one, seven. I'm going to go with seven. They shape. Okay, face detail. I honestly cannot tell what it's changing. Is it the lighting? Wow, it, it it's very difficult to see, <laughs> tell the difference of what is changing. It kind of looks like the shadows of the face, but I'm not sure. Okay, so I like five and six, six, five. Yeah, I can't tell. <laughs> Okay, I think six is good. Eyes. Is this the slant or the distance? Probably the slant. Ooh, we get to change the eye color. Ooh, the blue is pretty. Oh, actually, I really like this one. Nose. Okay, it's the length of the nose. I'll go with number two. Let's do two. Hmm. Do three. Okay. All right. Hair. Yeah, see, the difference is so, it's subtle. It's hard to see. I'll go with this one. Now the hairstyle. <laughs> that that one looks like a Talon. The Talon, the one with the hat.
That one's nice. Oh my gosh, I love... I love the feathers. Only thing, I'm not a fan of the fringe, the bangs. But I do, I love the, uh... Feathers. Hopefully... Hopefully we get more, uh, hairstyles later on in the game, because if I could get the whole adornment, beads, feathers, and everything, I would be so happy. Okay, so... Honestly, it's between that one... That one's nice, too. But I think I'm going to stick with the first... The first hair. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, skin. Here we go. Uh, hide clothes. So, this is the bioluminescence. Ah. It's too bad we can't see our not be. <laughs> <laughs> Since this is first person, that's one of my favorite things about uh, third person is seeing my character. Especially when I have different outfits on and you can customize your character. 10 is nice, so is 1. Yeah, I'm going to stick with 1. Skin pattern. Oi, oi, oi. Okay, I like two so far. I'm mostly looking on the face. <laughs> Not so much my body. Well, number 10 is also nice. Okay, 10, let's see. 10, 2. I'll go with number 2. Skin tone. Ooh, we got different shades. So far, I like the one that we have already. Ooh, do I want a more turquoise? Wait, this one's not. Whoa, look at that color. This one is nice too. Uh, <laughs> I think I'm gonna go with this one. The greener shade, yeah. Oh, beautiful. Hold on, let me check the eye color with that skin tone. I could definitely look like the Mekahina <laughs> clan with this, with this uh, combo. But I think I like the contrast of the greener eyes. So, what do we think? I think she's beautiful. Oh yeah, she's gorgeous. Okay, <laughs> I like it. I lost you. All of you. What's going on? What, what happened? Been asleep for a while. A long, long while. How oh, long? Gumbe. Oh! Must you prod them like this? If they can walk, they can walk. The rest we have to leave. Must you prod them like this? But the RDA left, didn't they? And you left us here. The sky people have returned, Sarandu. Sarandu? No one has ever called me that. That is your clan. 
and a mighty one at that. You thought you were lost to this world, but this Dreamwalker thought to lock you up in a box instead. <laughs> this Dreamwalker. Get back. But for now, you take it easy. Your body's still waking up. Wait, how long were we asleep for? Hold on. Uh, I am going to switch to my headphones because the audio sounded like it's 3D or it's like surround sound. <laughs> so I guess to get a better experience, I will switch to my headphones so I can be more immersed. Did we? Did everyone make it? I'm here. Lord and Daylan too. We're safe. <laughs> oh, look at his We're glowy! At last! It's really happening. We're all getting out. Together. Oh, why does it look so different in here? Can we hurry things up? RDA are en route. You can have your reunion later. Come, eat. You will need your strength. We found rations in the canteen. There's probably more. I think there's more. Find some food. It can be found in canteen storage. Where's the FD and Telesi? Maybe Alma sent them to a different cryo vault. Don't touch me with that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm... Treating Nafi wasn't really part of my training. Come on, come on, we gotta go. Who are these people? Wow. People? Is Mercer here too? No, no. These are friends. Wait. We're gonna get you out of here, all right? Oh, sorry. Why do I feel so stiff? How long did we sleep? Focus on eating for now. We need to leave soon. So where was... did I miss... Oh. <laughs> Stand up. I guess not. Wow, so I'm crouching. Oh. Okay. I'm guessing it's this green box here. RDA food container. Eat food to restore energy, bottom gauge. This allows health, top gauge to regenerate automatically. Hold L1 to open the food wheel and hold square to consume food. Energy is the bottom and health is the top. Return to Alma. She is in the cryo vault with the others. Fifty percent energy, land dry, and a bit past its expiration date. Its basic ration is still edible and quite filling. Cooked meal. Okay. Do I need both? All right. So we go back to Alma. Oh! RDA squad closing in! We should move! Oh crap. Okay. Everyone out! What? Oh wait, where are the others? John Mercer. Oh, they're alive. Parting. Cortez. She always thought we were making pets, not soldiers. Get rid of them. Oh, woo! We're 
Where do I go? Oh! <laughs> wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Yo, that is cool! Oh! Crap! Ooh! To jump higher or further, hold square to uh, charge jump. Oh, nice. Ooh. Ow. Ow. Owie. Wait, where do I go? Oh. <laughs> Nice. Oh! What? Wait, how did you guys see me? <laughs> well... I am like a... Oh no! <gasps> what? What? I was gonna say I am like a nine feet tall blue <laughs> person. One more made it. Over here. Huh? Are you all right? Oh. Talk to the Navi. Here, take this. A radio? Put it in your ear. It is tuned to our frequency. You've been busy. They were looking for you. They found me. You need to move now. Wait, what's your name? Sotle, one of the last of my clan. Sotle. I am here, so you will not be the last of yours. Keep moving, fast and quiet. Okay, Go. okay. Escape tap. Okay, thank you. Can you hear me? Yes. I hear you. The soldiers are everywhere. It's okay, breathe. Look for a way out. They not see me. So, like, can you hear me? Oh. Where is everyone else? Did they get out? I'm making sure they do. Are you safe? For now, I think. Let me worry about the others. Just keep moving. Well, I was gonna say it's really dark. I can't see. I am going the right way, right? <laughs> Crashing with circle will make it harder for enemies to detect you. When an enemy notices you, detection markers will appear and fill up. Present. Yeah, that'll work. What? Can't wait to exterminate them blue bastards. Ah, <gasps> what? How dare you? Heard they found a new area yesterday. Apparently, they finally found a way into that area. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. That was close. Oh.
Do not let them escape. Shoot to kill. Hmm. Should I just should I just make a run for it? You don't see me. You don't see me. <laughs> you don't see me. Can you ever just be quiet? Ugh! Door to the gym is locked. I'll try to find a way through. Stay watchful. Find a way to open the door to the Can't gym. Get in there. That's the gym? Well, that was easy. <laughs> oh. Oh no. The fruit looks. It'll kill you faster than the locals will. Can you ever just be quiet? I gotta go down here. Everything I see or don't see wants me dead. You're telling me. Okay, okay, okay. I had an amp too. <gasps> oh no! Welcome! Oh crap! Oh! Hold on, I, 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 uh. Where, where, where's the other one? I want to punch her. No! I came back just to do that. <laughs> oh, I can punch the humans. I love it. Okay, I'm out of the gym. Now get to them. Stop it! Oh, <gasps> was he caught? Oh. Oh, <gasps> are we close? There's nature. <gasps> oh, uh, how long were we asleep? Oh, is this our classroom? Yo. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Please tell me you're okay. Oh! Oh crap. Oh crap. Gotcha. Did you catch it, Harding? Ah, you don't gotta worry about this one. It hasn't got anywhere near the fight its sister did. Murder. Well, look where it got her. I did realize Ahadi was our shame. sister. They could have been of use once, but now there are no Navi ambassadors. Only Navi obstacles. Navi. Oh! oh! Okay, okay! So, like, oh my gosh, please don't die. <laughs> Solak, are you okay? That that was way too close. Solak. Oh no! Oh no! <gasps> oh my gosh, we're close. We're close. Wait, where am I? Just follow the light. Follow the light. gosh I'm almost out <gasps> wait no oh my gosh I got too excited <laughs> I'm almost free <gasps> get me out of here huh
Oh my gosh, I need a moment. <laughs> Hello? Maybe the others followed the water. Oh man, this makes me want to cry. <laughs> Search for Sotlek and other survivors. They may have... What? King or forest, they may have followed the stream. Oh yes, I cannot wait to get rid of those. <laughs> I don't like it. Oh! Oh, is this my, uh... Free stuff? Yay! Weapons. Sudden to hunter string. Sudden to hunter grip. Resistance magazine. Wait, what? Magazine, okay. <laughs> Resistance barrel. Sudden to hunter waist cloth. Sudden to hunter chest guard. Resistance tactical vest. Arm guard. Requires gameplay unlock of ankle guards. Bonus health. Hunter pouch. Shin guards. Oh, can I eat? 20 health. 2% stealth. Firearms damage. Can I change your clothes? Yes. 5% clan favor from quests and activities. I'll go with that. Two percent stealth. One percent range resistance. That is so much better. Oh, so much better, man. <laughs> Oh, I get a bow. Holy cow, wait, that is a beautiful bow. Oh my gosh, I love it. 5% <laughs> weak spot damage. Oh, it's a grenade arrow. Long bow. Longbow string, 5% weak spot damage. I already have a rifle. Ha! Nice! Five percent RDA damage, yes please. This is basic. Ah, cool. Okay, so I escaped from Tap and found myself home. Pandora at last. Search for Sotlek and other survivors. They may have followed. Oh, they may have followed the stream. Hunter's Guide. A tree often used by Nut Bee for basic crafting. Most commonly found along cliff sides in the King Bloor Forest. Rare night leaves trees are often found around the Blackwater Basin in the north of the King Bloor Forest. Best quality rain. The night leaf tree is perennial woody shrub that grows on rocky ground and cliff sides. It is notable for its distinctive violet striped leaves. Soja. Common RDA infantry usually deployed together in a squad with at least one amp. Uh, soldiers form the backbone of the RDA's military branch. They are relatively vulnerable in Pandora's hostile environment, and as such are often accompanied by amp suits. 
Their strength lies in their numbers and the ability to overwhelm their opponent. That said, even a single soldier can be dangerous when overlooked. Uh, spare parts that can be used for crafting containers holding large amounts of spare parts can be found in field labs throughout Pandora. Smaller amounts of spare parts can be found in most RDA facilities and resistance settlements throughout Pandora. Spare parts can be used to craft special ammunition or traded for equipment with certain resistance members. Sulfur pod. Oh. The flammable oil this pod is coated in can be used to craft special ammo. Most commonly found in great trees throughout Pandora. The, uh, the seed pod of an apophytic plant that grows on tall trees across the western frontier. The sulfur pod is a full of, is a full of fibrous vesicles containing a sulfurous flammable gel. There are uh, they are used by Navi in the Western Frontier as fire starters. Navi gather a number of seed pods, the seed bearing structures of a number of plants for the oils they contain. These oils have many uses, including the construction of arrowheads, spearheads, and as fire starters. Oh! Nimble longbow, a simple longbow that supports explosive arrows. Any branch. Oh, ammo. Long grenade arrows. So I need any stick, any sulfur pod, and spare parts. Fitted with RDA fragmentation grenades to deliver a payload of devastating blasts. <gasps> cool. I did see something about characters. Alma, tap teacher. Dr. Alma Cortez was a brilliant xenobiologist back on Earth, specializing in the study of alien cultural development. On Pandora, she ran the ambassador program TAP alongside John Mercer. <laughs> uh, she wanted to study not the culture up close and believed that she could bring them a better future. But Alma soon realized that the Nutbi are complex beings and far from the primitive savages Mercer insisted they were. In her avatar form, Alma took on the role of tap teacher and became almost a mother figure to the Sarantu children. When the Omatakaya rebellion happened and the RDA was forced to evacuate from Pandora, Mercer told Alma to shut down tap and terminate the assets. Hmm. The sudden two children. Yeah, he was going to execute everyone. Uh, she ignored those orders and secretly put the children into cryo sleep before escaping to Hell's Gate. She is one of the few humans Jake Soli uh, permitted to stay on Pandora after the rebellion, hoping she could unite Navi and humans. However, Jake, Jake does not know about Tap. Alma spends almost all of her time in her avatar form. Due to this, some people have never met her human form. Girl, I would totally do the same. <laughs> I would be in my avatar form all the time. Director of Frontier Operations. Apologies if you hear the chickens. I could hear I can hear them. They're making a ton of noise. Uh an ambitious businessman back on Earth. John Mercer was the founder of the Ambassador Program on Pandora. He hoped to impress the RDA with not be diplomats loyal to humanity, but when human relations with the not be clans soured, he was ready to make do with military and covert assets. Uh, with his methods growing more abusive, he personally shot Ahadi, the most rebellious of the Sarantu students at TAP. Yeah, she was our sister, right? Uh, when forced to evacuate from Pandora with the rest of the RDA, he callously ordered the remaining TAP students to be killed. Cole Harding. She was the one that caught us at the end. Career military Angela Harding 
first came to Pandora <sighs> to oversee security from the ambassador program, her direct and brutal methods were a constant source of anxiety for the students. Sarantu clan, Ahari. Rebellious and brave, Ahari was your sister and one of the oldest of the Sarantu children at TAP. Ahari. Ahari. I believe that's how it, her name is pronounced. She was the most defiant of Mercer and the program. She tried to hold onto her Nutbi heritage, encouraging the others to join her. Nor admired her strength and spirit, and they were close friends. Ultimately, her rebellion ended when Mercer killed her during an attempted escape from Tap. Aww. My sister. Okay. Oh! Can I touch these? <gasps> oh my gosh. I love it. I think... I think any Avatar fan knows... Knows about those. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, that sounded like a hurt. Oh, they're so cute. Wait. Why do I... Why do I look like I'm so close to the ground? Uh, from this point of view, I seem really short. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, in the water. Uh, yeah, just the sounds in my headphones. Of, um, I can hear it all around me. <laughs> oh, this is so beautiful. You guys are so cute. I love it. <laughs> that looks like it has gas in it. Oh man, I'm gonna get distracted so easily here. <laughs> yes, I know I'm supposed to go near the water. Whoa, that looks dangerous. Oh! More RDA. What happened? Search for salt. Uh, follow the trail of RDA wreckage. Look for the RDA fueling station northeast of Dyer's Bowl. Dyer's Bowl. Spinner's Circle Rainforest Biome. Lush rainforest of mixed density displaying a diverse range of trees brimming with eggs and fruit. Oh. Okay. Please do not be scared. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. 
Oh my gosh, look at it. Look at it. <laughs> Wait. Oh, look at the water. Ah. <laughs> Fishy! Honestly, the sound of water is my favorite. It's so calming. I wonder if I could swim in this game. I need a game specifically uh, oh, whoa, look at... Oh, dude. <laughs> wow, look. That arrow's... That arrow's big. Right in the face, too. Um, yes, I need a, a, a game just focused on, uh... The clan, the Kaina clan from the way of water. If I could swim. Oh, I see smoke. Fueling station. Is that gonna explode? Over here. Oh! <gasps> By the tree. Salt Lake. Oh! Salt Lake. He's alive! Oh, spare parts! Yeah. He's resting. Uh, wait, what? He's resting against a tall tree. Over here? Uh. This tree? Oh. Oh my gosh, you're alive. Now you see what they kept you from. Your true home. You saved me. Ah! You can't keep fighting. I will help you this time. <laughs> Was that my headless body? <laughs> you will need arrows. Wood in the underbrush is pliable. You will find it. Simply focus your senses. My senses? They taught you to be human, but you are not the... See the forest as I do. No, wrong button. You see, this is your home. It will speak to you. If you let it, let your senses guide you. User not be senses and inspect any highlighted plants, animals, and various other items by pressing L3 to get more information about them. Use your not be senses to find the archer's thicket. L3. Archer's thicket. Oh! A bush that grows tough stems, especially useful for crafting arrows. Gather wood from the archer. Okay. Okay, I got it. Now you have all you need to craft arrows as I do. Sharp enough to pierce human metal. Open the weapon wheel by holding L1, and then select the longbow and hold square to craft arrows. You are ready. Oh. We should get out of here. Holster? Dapafen. Uh, I need a pot. From a Dapafen plant. I'll find one. Don't worry. Uh, uh, near the shore. They grow by water. Uh, Dapafen. Ah. Uh. Uh, map waypoint. Press X to to place a waypoint marker on the map. This marker will appear on the compass so you can more easily navigate to the desired location. 
Okay. Uh, it was Hunter's Guide. It requires little additional work to clean and fletch these sticks into arrows. A dapafet. The fruits of the dapafet plant have powerful healing properties, most commonly found near water throughout Pandora. Okay. It said... Okay. Uh, let me get more of those archers thicket. Huh? Huh? I hear the humans. Is there a limit to how many? Wow, there's an abundance. I love it. Let me just grab as many as I can. What was that? Bladder polyp. Fountain tree. <laughs> A tree with water pods which burst when fully mature or damaged. Wait, what was the other one? Bladder polyp. A plant that has adapted to live in salty soil, able to store large amounts of water in its leaves. Ooh. Oh, is that where I'm supposed to go? Hold on, is there more? Let me grab more. Okay. Okay. Now we head this way. I hear, I hear stuff. <laughs> I, I can't find what you need. A double fit pot. The plant grows near water. Look through the lake. Focus on what you need. What is this? Unknown wildlife scent. Scent trail. Oh. So I guess that's good for when I'm hunting. Mist bloom. The mist bloom spores temporarily increase not the blood flow if inhaled. Improve speed and agility. What just happened? <gasps> huh? Soldiers. Oh. Whoa. Wait, how many of them are there? You love the sound of your own voice, don't you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everything. Don't you dare. Okay. Okay. Ooh, I definitely love the bow and arrow. Man, it's so good.
that the fa oh it's this so like i got the dapafet on my way back health there punch. are more soldiers oh man oh man dapafet pods are used for restoring your health tap left to quick heal in critical okay oh no did they get to him Hammerhead Titanothere. Weapon crafting material. Arm got. Oh. Oh man, so I do gotta go hunting around. Sturm Beast. Okay, okay, so like. I'm coming. Is he here? Oh. No! Hold on. You won't let them take him alive. There's heat. Let's let's change sides. Sweet. Maybe I should go up here. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Where are you? Going after it. Wait, where's it? Search pattern. You can't hide. Where did the human go? Anybody got eyes on this thing? 
Where are you hiding? The standard amps you use by RDA offering we'll points. Okay, okay. Where, where, where is the other one? Come out, come out, wherever you are! Bastard's not getting away. We just want to- Oh! Oh, I did a one shot. What? Uh, one shot. What? Oh. <laughs> Holy cow. <I> learn fast. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yo, I did the one shot for this one. Oh. Ooh, thank you. Wow, guys, I did my first self mission. <laughs> um, if you didn't know, I love doing stealth. May not be good at it, but I, I love doing stealth. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. I know, I know you need help. I know you need help. I'm sorry. <laughs> and this is how we heal. <sighs> ah! Ooh! I felt that. <laughs> you have no song cord. It was we stolen. Had mothers, but they stole it. We must change that. Mm hmm. Wait! What should I do now? Do? You must discover your own way, Sarento. And until then, join the resistance. But hear me. Those humans have the same enemy, but we're not the same. No, no. They are too close. Go. I'll meet you at base camp by the waterfall. Base camp by the waterfall. Okay. Wow. Not these senses. Uh, use the user not these senses to locate and navigate to quest locations. Not these senses. Oh. Yo, that was too fast. Find a way to climb the cliffs on the right side of the waterfall. That waterfall? Wait. Okay, I need to collect. Wow, guys. <laughs> oh! My pouch is full. Oh, okay. Oh, wait. Oh, what? Oh. Oh. Okay, before we go... Oh, wow. Sturm Beast. Whoa, look at that. Show weak spots and armor. Oh, cool. A massive bus uh, buffalo like herd beast with six legs and four long distance vision. <laughs> four long. <laughs> Cooking ingredient. Oh yeah, I forgot we are cooking in this game. So I guess we cook for our health. Because I am low on my energy. Heavy hide arm guard crafting. Okay, there was... Sotlet told me to find the Resistance base camp. Locate the Resistance headquarters. 
Find a way to climb the cliffs on the right side of the waterfall. Combat strength. Combat strength is a measurement of your efficiency and survivability against the dangers of Pandora and against the RDA. Improve your combat strength by crafting better equipment, gaining certain skills, or by acquiring new items from artisans. Completing quests and active and activities will also grant potential equipment upgrades. Hmm. Grenade arrow. 16 damage. Makeshift. Huh. Too bad it's like low. But I did get something new. Oh, but it's basic. Okay. Okay. Character. Salt leg. Freedom fighter. Uh, the first true nut V the Seren two have seen since they were children. Salt Lake is a taciturn, stern warrior who lost most of his clan in the Omatakaya Rebellion. Uh, while not fond of humans, he now fights the RDA with the resistance. Not as many would have escaped uh, the derelict tap facility alive without his help. Unusually for nut V, Salt Lake uses human weapons and has also created his own fighting style that combines the hunting techniques of his old clan with RDA technology, making him a powerful ally for the resistance. So, the Battle of the Hallelujah Mountains. That was eight years after our sister was killed. Was that, that was the great battle from the first film, right? When all of the Plans from around Pandora joined us. A Matkaya Rebellion. So, I wonder if this is before or after the uh, second film. I know it's after the first film, but I'm not sure if this is before or after. Ah. Uh, the second film. Okay. Uh, before I go... Oh! Oh, there's stuff to collect! <gasps> wow! Wow! Spare parts. Oh! I can use some food. Mm hmm. Is there anything else? Gotta collect stuff. Spare parts. More food, yes. Y'all, I'm going to be using my not these senses so much. <laughs> oh, I see something. Oh, there's a few things here. Spare parts. Secured container, a locked container which holds RDA firearms. Without RDA access, it can only be opened by hacking the security system. Oh. So, I don't have anything to hack yet. <laughs> but, I will be keeping an eye out for it. Bare parts. Ooh. 
Was there something on this side? I feel like there was. What is that? Oh, it's an animal. Hexapete. Solek? Solek, are you there? I don't know where I am. See the great cliffs by the waterfall. Find your way to the top. At the fall's crest, a hollow log points the way to our camp. I'm waiting for you there. Speckled mushroom, a strong yet highly flexible mushroom that can act as a natural trampoline. What? What? Wait, can I try? <laughs> is this is this animal just sleeping or is it dead? Dead? Superior? What? Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm saying oh, like I was just about to hunt it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Okay, which one was the trampoline? Was it this one? Oh, ugh, maybe not it. Maybe not that. Was it? Or was it this? <gasps> Whoa, wow! Wait, let's do that again. <gasps> oh, crew! What? What? <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> oh, am I able to hunt these? Life? When did it die? Did the humans kill it? <gasps> oh gosh. <laughs> Can I grab more of these? Is that it? Can I? learned <laughs> I should be able to hunt it but I probably don't have a strong enough bow <laughs> oh my gosh
Let me eat. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> that is so funny. Okay, <laughs> let's go over here. What are you? King Lorefor's vein pod. The pod of this plant is filled with gas and will burst if touch or damage. Ooh. That would be perfect for a... During combat. Lift vine. Lift vines can be used. Oh yeah, okay. The waterfall. Resistance base must be above it. Aww. Hold on, I'm really curious. What it? Oh. Oh, it ran. What should I try now? Ooh! Okay, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Maybe when I upgrade, <laughs> upgrade by, uh... <laughs> I'm being stubborn, I know, I know, I know. Okay, okay, okay. Does it matter which one I go up? I don't think so. Spare parts. Let's grab more. Okay. Put the gun away. Close lift finds. Fire at a close lift. Uh, to cause it to drop. Ooh, okay. New world knowledge. Oh, I didn't see these. Resistance HQ headquarters. Set in the heart of the King Lore Forest, Resistance HQ is the home of the Resistance. After the Battle of the Hallelujah Mountains, Jake Sully allowed certain human settlers to remain on Pandora. When the RDA returned, some of these humans left Hell's Gate to set up an active Resistance in the Western Frontier, with Resistance HQ as their new home. It has since been expanded to accommodate new RDA defectors. Well, the Western Frontier is on another continent of Pandora. Across the moon from where the Omatikaya live, the RDA was drawn here by the wealth of natural resources. John Mercer is Executive Vice President of Frontier Operations in this region with orders to gather materials and resources for RDA projects across Pandora. The Western Frontier is particularly rich in natural gases and fuels, making it key location for the RDA. Ah. Set 
Sarantu were a clan of traveling storytellers. They lived among different clans as if they were one of them, learning about each clan's ways and sometimes reflecting an outsider's perspective back to the clan. Respected diplomats, the Sarantu were often able to settle disputes within and between clans. Once a year, the, San the Sarantu left the clan they lived with to attend the Sarantu Moot, an annual gathering where the Sarantu clan would swap tales of their lives, regale their, famili uh, their families with inter-clan stories, and petition the Sarantu elders to be allowed to either stay in their current clan or move on somewhere new. Children of the Sarantu were marked at birth with a small family sigil under one eye, making it impossible to hide who they were and drawing attention from not be seeking a sympathetic ear wherever they went. Oh, that's so interesting. I'm not so much interested in the humans. <laughs> okay. Wait, where am I? <laughs> I did so much reading, I forgot where I was. Charge jump. To jump higher or further, hold X to perform a charge jump. Oh, wait, where am I? Oh, up here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sprinting charge jump. To jump even further, perform a charge jump while sprinting. Hold X, charge jump, sprint. Okay. Oh, got it. Ooh. Oh my gosh, look at the water. Can I, can I swim? Oh. Oh my gosh, I can swim. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Wait, how long can I be in under here? Oh, the current is moving me. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. Okay, I was starting to, <laughs> I was starting to drown. So like, I can't find the resistance base. I'm not... I'm not used to being out here. A door is still new to you. Perhaps I should not have left you alone. Look to the cliff face. Lift vines will pull you to the top. You will see the base from up there. Across shallow water, nestled in a grove of trees. A dap of that pod. That was, that was really funny. I was hoping I could, you know, last a bit longer underwater. A poached salt lake at resist Resistance Headquarters. Nice. Acrid Pod, crafting special ammo. You can now craft special ammo. Open the weapon wheel by holding L1. Select a special ammo type and hold square to craft. There's no empirical basis for that claim. Huh. I guess I don't have... Oh, the music! Oh, hello, humans! Data, data everywhere, and not a second to think. Hold on, can I look around for a bit first? Oh, young scent. Oh, okay. Is there anything to collect around? Yay, there is. 
Ooh. Dishes. Dishes come with various effects which can be useful in combat and or can make you a more efficient hunter and gatherer. Gorilla fighter grip. Wait, can I see what these are? Best quality dry, a plant with electrostatic tendrils that shock nearby threats. Best quality, wait, so I can harvest them? Ah, okay. So it seems like there's stuff to see inside. Oh, cooking station. What? Experiment with cooking ingredients to make dishes which, prov which provide temporary beneficial effects. Uh, ingredients have various effects. By using a specific ingredient in the primary cooking slot, you're choosing the type of effect the dish will grant. Cooking with an ingredient for the first time will reveal the effect type in it can contribute. Place an ingredient in the secondary cooking slot to determine the duration of the effect of the final dish. So the first slot is the type of effect and the second slot is the duration. The higher the rarity of the ingredients you use in a dish, the more potent and long-lasting its effects will be. Oh, superior. Should I try? But I don't know if I want to use this for the primary or the secondary, because it's a superior. But it lasts longer. Favorites and spe uh, specialties. You can add your preferred dish dishes at, as favorites. You can initiate cooking by selecting a recipe you have made before. Specialty dishes are dishes that have two effects. As soon as they are discovered, they can be consulted in your specialty list of recipes. Mm hmm. Okay, I guess let's try this. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Doing my first cooking. Arc skin, 10 minutes. Take 30% less damage from wildlife in RDA. A rich meat roast with veins of marbled fat. Okay. I probably should have switched the order of it, right? Wait, did I eat it? Did I eat it? Oh my gosh, I did! Oh no. Oh man. <laughs> I did not mean to eat it. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh well. I'm not even going to be attacking anyone. It is soundproof, Priya. <laughs> Darn it. I wasted my food. Sorry. Sorry, filter got stuck. Jin thinks he's got it figured out now. Oh my gosh, another one. I am so glad you're here. Another one? You know, there's so few of you left. Oh god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Welcome to Resistance HQ. <sighs> <laughs> uh. Right. Sorry. Oh well, Nati Kamie! Oh, Nati Kamie. <laughs> what? She's so excited. <laughs> Salt Lake is like, please leave her alone. <laughs> there you are. Over here. Okay. Use your not peace senses by holding to locate like you. quest objective. Everything's fine. Breathe it 
think I can make a jam out of thicket fruit. I reckon I could. Stun grenades. Oh, press square L1 to throw a stun grenade. Use stun grenades to temporarily immobilize enemies. Must check Dr. August's cool. research on this. Sulfur pod. What do I need? Oh, I can craft. Grenade arrows. Grenade arrows cause blast damage when they hit enemies. Switch weapon ammo type by using the... Oh. Rations are pretty low. Okay, cool. Let me know if you need anything. This is nice. I like this. The RDA are pestilence. They must be stumped out. Yes. Yes, yes, they should. Hey, got some new stuff ready. Craft. If I said it'll hold, then it'll hold. I can't, uh, I cannot craft anything yet. I stay as long as it is useful to the cause. Representing the resistance, nice. Cure it, Ahenaku. Trade. Come to gear up. Oh. So I don't have enough for anything. Poisoned arrow. Oh, I like that. Oh, but my damage goes down. Hmm. Okay. I won't, I won't get Remember, anything. Remember, point away from the user. <laughs> yes, yes. Nothing a little duct tape won't fix. I know. Inventory is full. Oh, cool. Some of those fruits smell so great, though. Just want to tear them off the tree and sink your teeth into them. Mm-hmm. Yes, well, processing those is a whole science unto itself. The it's a challenge. The spaghetti's part of a much larger machine that's pushing its way across Pandora. Haven't heard from Jake in a while. But judging by the chatter we've caught, General Ardmore still wants his head on a platter. And why wouldn't she? All that stuff he's been pulling. Stealing all those weapons. I wish I'd been there to see it. Or well, maybe once the clans here agree to unite under our cause, we too will be able to do something like that. Right now, we just don't have the numbers for it. I can only hope Jake continues to keep Ardmore occupied. Harding's bad enough, but Ardmore is a four-star general. Harding. A good one. Oh, I remember her. She's a perfect tool for the RDA. Smart, but brutal. If anyone stands a chance of actually colonizing Pandora, it's her. Hmm. Jake is hitting RDA mining camps and supply drops. We can do the same over here. Recon shows mining camps are largely concentrated in sectors three and four, but it looks to me that they're starting to spread out. I'm not sure how they're targeting particular spots. But Priya thinks the balloons we've seen might be fitted with scanners. I, I need to look into that. And we'll hit the supply drops in small teams. Try to get in and out before the RDA arrive for pickup. <sighs> I'm trying. I am really trying to do what I can here to make up for some of the mistakes that I've made in the past. Oh, this is nice. I, I guess only time will tell if it was enough. Sa rentu. Sa ren. Two. Dragon? Saren two. Saren two. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Oh, a hammock. Beautiful. It's quite 
big in here. Hey, hi, Anka. Just a quick message about the... Oh, it's Priya, by the way. But you knew that. Anyway, just a message about that part I was needing for the radio. Just wondered if any of the scouting parties had found one. Also, missed you at lunch today. Jin Young said that you'd left just before I arrived. Not that I asked. He just, you know, like, told me. And I was like, no way, too bad. Coffee? So anyway, if you do get that part, let's hook up. I mean, meet. Let's meet up. For the party. Okay, bye. Well, the party. Oh, cool. I, I wanted to look around a bit before I go to She's the next thing. To listen and give some advice. Well, sure. But she seems pretty busy with those not be they rescued. Well, that is true, but don't you think they could use that advice more than most right now? I do not understand their attempts. <laughs> I do not understand their attempts at humor. We made it to the Western Frontier. Everything is moving so fast. Uh, I didn't... Yeah, moving so fast lately. I didn't expect to be fighting against the RDA. Nobody expected it. Well, maybe Jake did. Ajir. Found in the resistance headquarters. I suppose stuff like that is on a need-to-know basis. Jake's continuing the fight from a new location. Everyone's rattled seeing the RDA tear through the sky again and land on Pandora. It's weird seeing it from the other side, feeling what it's like to be invaded, the fear and uncertainty. So when they said that He's fighting in a new location. Is that when he's with the Amata? I mean, the Metkayina clan. I'm writing like this in my world now. It can never be. But I've left the mark here, a scar. If Jake finds out about Feral's, oof, <laughs> he never would have left. Let me stay on Pandora if he'd known. God, I hope he never finds out. The Feral's. Knowing what I know now, I'd like to think I've. I'd have done things differently. Guess I was fooling myself. Like, I could bring some humanity to the RDA's corrupt corporate machine. They only tore some out of me instead. Did I really think I was special? Like, it was possible to be a part of something like that and not be corrupted by it? Complicit in, in pain. Suffering. At least I'm on the right side this time. Damn, I used it up. <laughs> okay. The inevitable return. Never has something been so beautiful. Okay, Alma. Here you go. I'm recording my feelings. <sighs> what a waste of time. She thinks I have stuff to process. She's a doctor. All right. <laughs> through and through. Pollution. Decisions like this aren't easy. It's not like I don't want kids. And I know Jin will be the most incredible dad. But family planning was kind of cut short. He knows that. Circumstances are different. We're not turning around at the end of a five-year tour and going home. We're resistance now. If we have kids, it'll be here. Pandora. I'm not doing that in a war zone. And even if we were safe, it's never really safe here. I don't know if I can do it at all, really. I don't know what kind of mom I would be. Would I be better than mine? Jin would balance me out. I don't know. If he can just hang on a little longer. Till things settle a bit. Maybe we could talk about it again. Hmm. Okay. Great. <laughs> I'm so glad to see you. Hey, lad. We heard the shooting and Alma said to run for it. Are you okay? Shaken. Sotlek got me out. Where are the others? 
the Nella and Nor made it too. But they decided to spend time outside. I don't think they should. Isn't it dangerous? <laughs> don't worry, you're all safe now. That's what matters. What happened back there? Tap was in ruins. Mercer ordered it destroyed when they evacuated. I watched the walls collapse in. On you. I thought you were dead. Then Priya heard the RDA on the radio talking about a signal at TAP. I was afraid to hope. How long were we in there? It feels like you left yesterday. It, uh... <gasps> should feel like that for you, but... Sixteen years? It's been nearly sixteen years. What? Sixteen? Alma! That can't be right! Y you need to understand. Seeing you all again today, you, you have no idea how much that means to me. I failed you. I won't make that mistake again, I promise. Look, take some time. Raj will get you cleaned up. Taylan knows his way around already. He can show you. This can be your home now. You'll see. Sixteen years. It doesn't feel real. Wow. Yeah, I... I don't know. I don't know what to think about that. Almost right, though. We can be at home here. I feel it. And it's cool here, right? So much cool tech. Exactly. But now what? What's the big picture? Colonization? Of Pandora? <laughs> He's over there. Uh, that's Raj? He's cool. Kinda. I think everyone's just getting used to us being around. I mean, talk to they'll probably last Ranj and DR and the but living quarters. Just like back home. These are closed systems. You could pretend they're not for only so long. Oh. Who's up for movie night? You must be Raj. It's Rajinder. Rajinder. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> Alma said. I know Alma. Alma calls me Raj. I don't know you. <laughs> I, I'm new. <laughs> Relax, new. I knew you were coming. Sleeping all this time. Oh, you must be well rested. I have fresh clothes ready for all of you. Alma didn't tell me you were missing a sense of humor as well. <laughs> ha, nice, nice. Receive new gear from Ranjin there. In the living headquarters. You need a new look. Do I? Field waste cloth. Wow, but it brings my health so low. Ten percent firearms damage. Two percent range resistance. Belt pouch. I wasn't finished. Yes, well, look good out there. What'll it be today? Yeah, that's too low. <laughs> yes, yeah, well, look good out there. What? I have to get those? You need a new look. I guess so. I guess so. Keep yourself in one piece. Change into not be clo- Open. What? I gotta change? Oh my gosh. But, 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 but. Oh, mods. 10% firearms damage. Ooh, I'll go with the- Bonus health. Okay. Mods. This is the RDA? Okay, let's do that. Okay. Do you... Can I give you anything for these? You get a freebie this time. Special circumstances considering. Usually, we take what we can get around here. 
If you find something good, let me know. Yes. Not me clothes. Do they feel weird? I think I like them. Hmm. Well, I want to keep my hat. And some other bits. And try out some of the tech. You have to meet this Alex guy. He's like an inventor. <laughs> you settled in fast. Well, it's weird being out of tap. But everyone here has been super nice. Halad has always been very acclimated to the human... human world. Talon! Can't keep away, I see. And you brought another Navi. Hello. Alex builds stuff. Mechanisms and technology for all kinds of communications and discovery. And a little chaos, if I have the tuning right. <laughs> <laughs> see this? This is Sid, my systems interrogation device. Good name, right? Bit of a mouthful, perhaps. Ajir thought it was a little much, but what does he know? <laughs> this, I designed it with Navi in mind. The sound of a his little voice. troublemaker for RDA technology. Cobbled it together with old RDA parts. And top parts. Yes, well, we could probably scratch that off or paint over it, you know, if, if you like. I've been trying to get Alma to test it. Oh, we can test it. Can we? We can test it? Mm -hmm. That could be fun. I can make one for each of you. Go ahead. Get a feel for it. Cool. Sid, equip Sid, hold L1, triangle. I'm actually hoping it can find the faulty wiring in our air filtration. See the wires running under the floors here? You should be able to track those to the maintenance panels. Give it a go. Aim at the node and lightly press R2 to find the correct frequency. Both circles must overlap. Wait. I oh. My data shows a fault upstairs as well. Probably that damn wiring. Mind yeah. taking a quick look? The tool should lock on to the frequency. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. You can detect uh, specific. I miss lemons. Sid will produce feedback as you move. Oh my gosh, there's so much information going on. <laughs> it's like I'm trying to listen to him talk, but then I'm trying to read. Do you think they're getting much from the mind? Find the frequency, aim. Okay, okay. Hey, Alex, I think I found the fault. Just a little hack, and the system will reset. Do you mind? Oh. Oh, wow, I'm moving it too. I think I got it. Ah, you see, it is a useful tool, isn't it? I told Alma this, this is our future. I must say, I'm looking forward to seeing what you do with it. Nice to have one's work come to something. But I've ordered you about enough. Alma's gathering everyone for a briefing. I believe your friends are still exploring outside. Meet the Sarantu outside Resistance Headquarters. They are sheltering next to a fire in a small cave below the building. The children are finding their own ways. When equipped, Sid highlights RDA devices you can hack. <gasps> oh, I should... I should go back to the fueling station then to hack that... Uh, Processed Sturm Beast kind of looks like steak. Yeah, almost. To hack into that box that I couldn't open. Okay, I am going to change back my clothes. <laughs> I don't... I don't need some weak stuff. This. Okay, they are... Oh, <gasps> wait! I did not notice my controller is lit blue. Oh, it switches between blue the RDA and turquoise. I feel nothing will ever go back to the way it was. Let's see. Oh, it's hard to see. But the lights on here is blue. 
Well, I think I can make a jam out of thicket fruit. It switches. I, I could. It switches between blue and turquoise. Wow, that's pretty cool. Oh. Okay. I must help them survive. So. Are they right there? I see something up there. I need to remember to check it. Hello! There you are! Thelan said you made it out. I'd forgotten how it feels to simply sit in the breeze. Taste the sweetness on the air. Not listen to Mercer talk about their civilized culture. There are more colors than I remember. I have no names for them. We'll learn their names. We'll relearn all the Sarandu ways. Mm -hmm. Why do you think Alma waited to bring us here? Why didn't she check Tap before? Maybe it wasn't safe before. It's not safe now. Who cares? We are free. I want to run, until my lungs ache and my legs give out. We could leave, you know. Right now. Where would we go? <laughs> Wherever we want. All of us. What do you think? You, me, Rinella, Telan? We could live as Sarentu again. Alma brought us here for a reason. She's gathering everyone inside to talk. She must have a plan. Don't stay here for her. She wants to control you. All the humans do. No, they don't. Alma was always kind to us. The people here like her. And they're nice, aren't they? They seem nice. Uh, Priya let me use her radio. I believe they want to help us. Let's go see what Alma wants. Maybe... Maybe it's something fun? <laughs> something I fun? I doubt that. Nord. Please! Come on! Everyone's waiting! Fine, fine. Just give me a minute. The light is different out here. Oh! I want to enjoy it. Haven't we spent enough time in metal boxes? At least tonight, we'll sleep under the stars. Like our families did. Bark skin. Take 30% less damage. That armor fits you well. Will I ever feel truly not be? 30% or 35% self damage ambush 10 minutes. Ooh, okay. Is there anything else? What is this? I should get out of HQ a bit more. Explore Pandora. Stash. Wait, what? A place where you can store materials, food, gear, and assorted things for later usage. Solek oh. might know the answer. Oh. So I can put things that I'm not using? Well, no, I don't I want to keep my food. I, I think I ate too much. <laughs> so good. I guess I could put the stuff that I don't even use. I might keep that. I'll keep that just in case. Would the Nutley accept me as one of their own? Yeah, sorry to the old school Nutley clothes. I will be keeping those. Oh, cool. Nice. Okay, there was something that what is that? Maybe I'll take it oh. Talon's log. Mm, no. Tech log by Talon. Talon's technological Oh, I I'll name this later. Solek is giving me funny looks. But 
This is home now. I like it. It's a bit different, though. People here don't really ask me to do anything. Alma said I can keep some things from Tab, like my hat. And I have my radio from Mercer. It's still broken, but I'm opening it up right now. Might be able to do something with the wiring. I'm keeping track of everything I fix here. A list for Alma. We have a lot to catch up on. Sixteen years. I bet she really missed us. Mm. She told me a story once, in tap, about a girl who slept for 100 years. It wasn't true. 100 it's years? Just a story. But Alma's body sleeps too. She said her body, her real body, is asleep while she walks around in her avatar. Mm hmm. So I guess 16 years of sleeping isn't so bad. What did we do while we slept? I don't remember having any dreams. Well, well, my radio. I think... I think it made noise. The level of contaminants in the air is concerning. There's a oh. diplomatic solution at the end of all Do this. I need to go back outside? I have to go... Is it over here? Oh no! Where did I come to? Oh, fishy! Oh, the bioluminescence! Oh, it's so pretty! What is this? Gathering controls. Gathering of Pandora requires a careful approach to avoid da uh, damaging plants. To gather plants, gently press R2 and rotate. Oh, oh. Okay. I. Then pluck it with R2. Oh. And it's the perfect condition. Oh, okay. Let me grab more. Pristine bonus. Gathering without making any mistakes will result in pristine gathering bonus. When gathering the plant during the preferred condition, you receive the optimal condition. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't. So I can use this in crafting. This will increase the core stat of the plant. Oh, that's very cool. At some point, the gathering tutorial will no longer be displayed when you gather. Looking at the plant and noticing the rumble of feedback will give you all the information you need. Oh, they need to leave the prompt up a bit longer. <laughs> Was that it? Was that it? Is there any more? Oh, that's really cool. Can it go up here? What is up here? Yay, food. <laughs> I guess I could head down now and see. Well, I did not mean to jump on that. Oh, 
I totally missed this. Oh, and here. What is that? Okay. I can hear the guitar. John Mercer, founder of the TAP program. The Saturn to know him all too well, but for many of you, he is a new face. He has returned to Pandora as the executive vice president of Frontier Operations, alongside your old friend from TAP, Colonel Angela Harding as his head of security. He is ambitious, self-serving, egotistical. And you worked with him. Mm -hmm. We have been fighting the RDA for many months now. What difference can this man make? Mercer's tactics are aggressive. That, coupled with his frustrations over Tat's failure, we need to strategize. Our outreach work with the nearest clans has been difficult. Some Aranaihe were willing to fight, but after suffering and losses on their side, they have since withdrawn. Mm. We haven't explored further than the Zeswa. They're fierce, but they're unwilling to make a human alliance. Your clan was one of travelers, storytellers, diplomats. Respected. The Navi might listen to you. Uh, Alma? We have a pollution spike close by. Like, really close. Check out the levels. RDA, it has to be. They're here. With Mercer. No, not him! Pollution is caused by RDA machinery. They must be setting up a regular drill site. Oh. Carving up the land. Poisoning it. Turning it to sludge. They've never been this close to HQ before. If they go wandering, they'll find us for sure. We're spread thin right now. I'll go. Solik, <laughs> can you establish a safe perimeter? Anka, I gotta try do and it. Zero over radio. I can try to shut down that drill site. I think I have the hang of Sid now. I don't think that's such a good idea. I volunteer. Let them go. I've seen them fight. They'll be fine. Okay, but be careful. The rest of you, get ready to intercept any other patrols. Keep your radios on. Be ready. If the RDA see you at their drill site, they will engage. Remember what I taught you. Craft your arrows, focus your senses. There are supplies by the main airlock should you need. Uh... Defeat pneumatic tower echo. Okay. I don't think I need to... I already have the highest stuff. Yeah. Oh! Nothing but scraps here. Gotta get all the good stuff myself. Okay. Okay. All right, let's start heading out. Okay. Do I stay on here? Oh, there's an animal close by? Ooh. Okay, okay. No time. Hopefully I have enough food for me. What was that? What was that? Oh, polluted! Oh! <gasps> Whoa! Wow! That was a drastic contrast. <laughs> We're already in the polluted area. Okay. Oh, 
the animals. Hey, Priya, I'm near the drill site. The ground here, it's... Every time the RDA sets up somewhere, it's the same thing. Their equipment pollutes everything around it. Everything. But hey, Pandora is strong. You shut down those drills and the land will recover. One sec, I'll check the schematics. You have those? Being ex-RDA's gotta have some benefits, right? I'm kidding. They, uh, they're not fun people. <clears throat> Looks like we've got two things here. The cooling unit on the drill and a generator. Probably at the edge of their site. What about the RDA? Well, you can probably shut down the site without engaging them, if you want. Unless, you know, they see you doing it. Oh, so I can stay stealthy. Just... RDA facilities, use your not these senses to more easily spot and target the vulnerabilities of the RDA facilities. Destroy the generator, hack and destroy the cooling unit. Hey you guys, it is me from the future. I am so sorry to cut the video at such a juicy part. <laughs> Just when we were getting into some action, right? But uh, I did record my first video originally in two parts and I was going to incorporate the second part into this first video but as I was editing I, I spent so much time like really exploring and I guess the way that I was progressing through the story and the missions the video would have ended up being about four to five hours long <laughs> so I decided to Cut the video in half and make it two parts instead. So, yes, at least we know that next video we are starting straight off with some action. <laughs> and yes, we are going to have a couple of missions where we kick some human booty. <laughs> but just for this first episode, I think we did good escaping from the RDA, arriving home to Pandora, and yes, just learning the mechanics for the game it it was honestly a lot to take in all at once a lot of information to retain and so it was quite overwhelming which is why i did spend a lot of time exploring and practicing uh the mechanics and the combat but of course with how long the videos turned out i did cut a lot of that out <laughs> But yeah, as you can see, the effect that Pandora and just the world of Avatar has on me, it really, it really is <laughs> incredible to experience for me. I absolutely love it so much. Yes, I think it will take some time for me to get used to the first person point of view I honestly wish it was in third person. I just, I'm so used to that point of view, but I also enjoy seeing my character and especially during cutscenes when it's like watching a film and seeing my character, especially since I got to customize her, seeing my character in the cutscenes along with the other characters, I would have loved that. But I understand why this game was made in first person because I guess being in Pandora and wanting to explore the world, it does make sense to put it in first person because it makes it more immersive. So I do understand why it was in first person, but yeah. <laughs> I am realizing how ruthless the humans are. <laughs> I mean, I already knew, right? from the films and just, you know, living in the world that we do. <laughs> the humans are quite ruthless. So when I was fighting at the fueling station and I got caught and they just ran after me. <laughs> and yes, I was getting quite nervous because I'm still getting used to the combat. I'm happy I decided to change to my headphones because, oh my gosh, if you play this game yourself, you will know that the audio, <laughs> there's so many sounds going on in the world of Pandora. All the creatures, you can hear them. You can hear the sounds of the flora, the weather, 
It's just surround sound. So it really does feel like I'm there. It's sort of like when you go to a theme park and you go on those simulated rides where the seat shakes and they have these effects around you that make it feel like you're there. Either it's like wind being blown or like spray of water. So it feels like you're getting wet. Yeah, it's kind of that feeling having the controller um, with the haptic feedback and the surround sound. Yeah, it's incredible. I loved it. I am looking forward to, you know, improving my combat, getting better. I am a player that really loves to focus on improving my combat. So when I start a game, I do love to practice, whether it's on camera or off camera on my own. I often practice to get better and, you know, really be able to experience the game the way it's supposed to be. Yeah, I'm really excited to go around harvesting and uh, upgrading my gear, improving my combat, and, you know, being a true nubby. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you are not a fan of Avatar, I hope you enjoy the game and the story for what it is. And yes, take it as a new experience. So I'm excited for you guys to watch the next the next episode because we do get into some more combat and I do explore more on camera for you guys. So yeah, stay awesome and I'll catch you guys in the next video.